So now that everybody out the way, son, and then start now with Vid there, Gabby and Chad, and then got a dose of Andre and Kate. Kate, you had there, now she was married, huh? You can let that one sip your hand, your mouth, huh? I'm a Demara again. Ooh, you love being a Demara, don't you, honey? Too bad this is going to pay out for you. Depending on what you do, it may or may not pay out on you. Unless you plan on blackmailing Andre for the, the little niggas he got, which is probably not much. That's why he's so desperate to be the leader of the of the mayor in the part where he can get him some money in his pocket. We'll see how far this mayor is going. I'll be sitting back laughing at it. Uh-oh, so Chad tried to start the shit already by saying, Kay, I congratulate you for doing what you're doing, trying to say the fit company business and the family business and all, but you know you stuck with this clown back here for a while, right? Because they didn't expect you to be married here for a good time, right? Hello, I'm standing back. Andre, you a ghost at this moment. Don't nobody care that you're behind it. To be all honest and be all serious. Andre, you could be standing in the door in the window. We still wouldn't care that you right there. We gonna still talk about you. You ought to know this by now. Because you is the elephant in the room when it comes to this marriage. Theo, are we still confused about sex? Didn't Chad go through the birds and the bees with you already and told you don't do nothing you don't feel comfortable doing? So now we got more... Theo, just wait till you... Just wait till you about 30 to have sex then. How about that? Just wait till you then. Marlena, get your little sport-ass granddaughter. Take her back to the center of Hong Kong, would you? Marlena for to get her ass about that tape now, and I can't wait to hear this. Oh, my gosh. Marlena is laying it on thick. <laughs> Claire, if you don't want to cry, you might want to start crying. Marlena is giving it to you hard. Um, How does she know y'all have sex? If Theo gonna be okay with you bragging that you having sex with your boy, ooh, Marlena, no. see that's why you don't get, that's why you don't let no doctor talk to you or try to they self punishing you, cause that's sure they find them hard hitting questions that you don't want to answer and you are afraid to get an answer to. She's gonna be answering the right questions at the right time. Nah, Gabby, nice try though, but Kane ain't gonna never find a love of her line. They either got to abuse her, talk to her, or treat her like she's something off the screen. If they ain't doing none of them, them not her perfect man. I'm just sitting back waiting patiently until Andre start doing these little three traits that she look for in the man. They got to be rich. They got to talk to her like a dog, treat her like a dog, control her, tell her what she can and can't do, and she'll be happy. That's all a girl asks for. That's all Kate asks for. They ain't all what a girl asks That's all what Kate asks for. Excuse me on that one. Yes, that the hell you was doing, see it, Claire. You was trying to have sex with that boy that clearly wasn't ready for none of that. And you thought that was on security bass men to secure the damn boy. For yet, hell for years you did. Let Marlena dad diagnose your ass. She doing a great job. I ain't even got to open my goddamn mouth. I'm just going to let Marlena make your ass feel stupid and diagnose your ass. How about that? I ain't going to say a word. Oh, so that's what we call it, Andre, a slip of the memory. Talking about some who going to share, where we going to share rooms, you and Kate. Yeah, you can forget about that ever happen. It ain't, it's summertime. It ain't much winter time. So that's not going to happen. Help has not frozen over yet. So you just losing your damn mind really now, Andre. You really thought you and Kate was going to share a damn room. Keep drink as Aerosmith say, dream, I'm, dream on, dream on. Oh, now, Julie, this what I like to see. The sweet, innocent old lady, you. Not the, I ain't the B word, you. We like to see the sweet side of you. That is a nice gesture. That is very nice to you, though. I appreciate you sometimes, Julie. Not all the goddamn time. Oh, so Marlena gave her one of them little nice, nasty diagnosing conversation. So Marlena made her ass think about her whole relationship all over again. Make her make sure this is what you want and that you try to love him for him, not trying to keep him. Mm -hmm. So now she handing over the letter Sierra wrote him that saying she loved him. So what, he finna go run out to Sierra now? I wouldn't be surprised if he do. Lord Melina had your ass thinking, huh, Claire? Two head that your head exploded. 
All Andre need is a good cussing on, and he'll sit his ass down somewhere trying to, still trying to fuck with Gabby. I hope you got that and put that in your mind and let it process, Andre. You got three people against your ass. Do you really want the whole house against you? Because you don't like your husband, because you don't like your brother girlfriend. Really, bitch? You not sleep on her, you ain't kissing her, you ain't got the love for her. But you real respect her. If not, you can get your ass back. You finally made it into the goddamn mansion, and now your ass finna fuck it up in two seconds. Right, cause it's hard to ignore her, say hello, and keep it pushing. You have to be an asshole, really, Andre? Okay, go ahead and get kicked back out the mansion again. You know you love to get kicked down. Wait, 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 wait. I thought Chad and Gab would say they were gonna... Well, I guess they're not going to stay there. I thought they were going to live with each other. So, Andre really ain't got to deal with Gabby that much. All he had to do was deal with her where she come over to spend time with Chad or whatnot. Andre, if you don't get over your goddamn self and move on, okay, fuck around now. Remember, now you just got in. Don't get your ass kicked out. You better enjoy that nightcap and continue to enjoy them. You gonna be all on the damn street again, or living in a cake hotel room, or whatever the hell she got y'all was saying in. In the way it's over, y'all, that was the episode. I see y'all soon for something. Don't forget to like, share, comment, and subscribe. Enjoy the rest of y'all day. Bye.